Hey, how are you cool people? This is Lucas. Hey, guys, also. And welcome to Pokemon Insurgents. But not just any new Let's Play. It's something I'm going to be, you know, doing to celebrate. Yes. 100 subs. That's right, guys. I finally ate 100 sub sandwiches. But, uh, <laughs> but seriously, I reached, uh, 100 subscribers. Not too long ago here. So, uh, I'm planning on, you know, starting a new series. My first Pokemon series, though not a legitimate Pokemon. Um,. Yeah, it's a fan-made Pokemon game called Pokemon Insurgents, as you can read on the screen. Um, and uh, it's interesting, and it has a lot of... Uh, it's just really interesting and fun, and it has a lot of uh, challenges to it. And it's supposed to be like... Even though it's, you know, Pokemon fan game, it's different kind of storytelling. And, and it adds actually fan-made like uh, Pokemon, which is something pretty cool. So, uh, let's get down to business. Yeah! Okay. One of my fonts, the system, and then. Uh, might have to turn on the music if I can. Uh, and I did try to do this before, as you can tell. But, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna do a new game. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's get started. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. So, this first episode is gonna be long. I might make it like 30 minutes or so. So, uh, <laughs> yes. Welcome to Pokemon Insurgents. Current version, this expansions. Um, so we're going to darker. Cause, you know, dark can be fun. Yes. So people will, you know, die and stuff. And it's all going to be a good day. Just going to turn this down a bit. <laughs> okay. So torn region one year ago. <clears throat> Thank you all for coming. We live d in dark times, my friends. A grave loss has recently befallen us all. The Augur was a great man. Not only was he an unmatched trainer, but his heart burned with the desire to protect his people. He was our hero and possibly the best leader the Torn region has ever known. But as you know, where there where other regions have evil teams or organizations, its Pokemon worshipping cults call the Torn region home. But to these cults Religion is so much more than just believing. They won't rest until the world is remade exactly how they want it to be. For our protection, the Augur defeated and expanded over half of them. He saved us. A week ago, he went searching for one of the remaining cults. He has not returned. He hasn't been seen since. People of Torin, I like you do not believe our Augur was dead. I assure you, I will search tirelessly until he is found again. With a heavy heart, I accept the burden of taking his place with his place until he 
is found. Until the first Aga returns, I shall be the second. I promise you, I will use every resource at my disposal to find him. We will stand our ground. We will not let these cultists, these insurgents, split apart our families and destroy the place we call live long live the torn region live long the torn region we will remain strong uh. alright would you lay yes of course we're doing a challenge dog okay so you know, as you know, I played you know some of this, so I kind of understand what's going on here. So, uh, what we're going to be doing here is a nuzlocke and a challenge, and I guess mystery challenge. I'm not actually too sure what mystery challenge is, but eh, might as well. Definitely not going to do a fucking solo run. Fuck that. Fuck that noise. This is the only time my curse is going to be used, really. You have chosen to do an egg lock. Yeah. In this challenge, the first 20 boxes of your PC will be filled with eggs. You must make an omelet with all of them. All those eggs must be different kinds of omelets. <laughs> you will not be able to interact with these boxes until the last four boxes are for you to use. Once you catch or receive a Pokemon, it is swapped out at random for an egg in the PC in those boxes. The eggs can either be taken from a text file in the egg lock folder or randomly generated. Dog we're really, really generating that egg. Yes, sir. In the Nuzlocke challenge, faded Pokemon will not be healed at Poke Centers. Revive Ash, Sacred Ash, and other ways to revive your Pokemon will also fail. In Mystery Challenge, all Pokemon appear as blanks to you. You cannot identify them until they are registered in your Pokédex. Well, shit. <laughs> okay, Mystery Town's going to be annoying. But alright. Hello? Is this thing working? <clears throat> Hello? Is this thing working? Can you hear me? Lipsies? Oh, thank Arceus. You're not gone just yet. You've got, uh, you've got to listen to me. It'll return any minute now. You need to stay focused and remember all you can. If you value your memories at all, you'll listen to what I have to say. We need to be quick. You at least remember your name, right? Mm, I'm just gonna go with. Hmm. Yeah. yeah, why not? Lux. Wait, no, 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 no. I'm bringing back an old classic. Deluxe. Not to be confused with his cousin, D's Nuts. Oh yeah, I, I made that joke and I feel bad. Are you sure? Hell yeah! Okay, okay. Good, you remember your name. What else do you remember? Are you a boy or a girl? Yo, I'm a boy. And do you remember what you look like? Um... 
Well, I can either be a pasty blonde guy, a pasty purple guy, or a tanned brown haired guy. Uh, let's just go. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> We're going purple. Yee. Thank goodness. If you know who you are, this might not be so bad. Oh, wait a second. Alright. Thank goodness. If you you know who you are, this might not be so bad. Oh, there's a Gengar. Here it is, Deluxe. You need to wake up. I've sent someone to fend it off and get you out of there. <coughs> you need to work up. <laughs> all right. But all right. The door is locked and the gang all's doing a drink. Soon Dreamator will rid the prisoner of the last of his memories. Hopefully, we'll be done within the hour. Well, how is our youngest prisoner faring? According to the computer, miss, Ferris phone, their memories should be completely gone very soon. Everything's going as planned. Excellent. Finally, we'll have fulfilled our end of the bargain. Good work, you two. We are starting the ritual soon, in the upstairs room. Will you be attending? Of course, miss. I will never miss a sacrifice. Very well. I'll see you upstairs then. Miss, wait. I have a question. After the child's memories are gone, what do you plan on doing with them? Kill them, of course. I expect you upstairs within two minutes. Um, why are we bothered to wipe their memories if we're just going to kill them anyways? No clue, but things are not asking that in front of her. You know how she hates me to ask question. Let's go upstairs. Then it's all fun to see the original being fucking performed. Oh. Okay, so we need a Ghostbuster. Is it me as a Ghostbuster? Yeah! Busted makes me feel good! Gengar is, Gengar is gone. Go. Follow Mew. Get out of here. And never look back. Good luck. Busted! Busted makes me feel good! Okay, hey. Mew is chilling out, relaxing and all, relaxing all cool. Playing b-ball outside the school, then a couple of kids who were up to no good. Started making trouble in my neighborhood. Got one little fight and my mom got scared and he's still sitting around and going to my hair. God damn it. <laughs> I like. See, now, this is the... So, apparently we got the first Mew of Bel-Air, first Prince of Bel-Mew, so... So, Fresh Prince, how are you doing? Does Bustin, does Bustin make you feel good? <laughs> Alright. Lot, yeah. Okay, yeah. I think one of these says, oh, oh, yeah, this one. Yeah, give me the good, good. Oh, yeah, you know what? Let's check out them. What's this Mew all about? What's this story? 
Alright. So it's a naive, okay, yeah. It's naive and synchronizes and very much better than usual. Okay, cool! Okay, cool! Oh, wait. Yeah! See? See? This is the great things in this. There's great things in this. Oh, hey. Oh, fuck. Damn it. No. I'm using the arrow keys, by the way. So, and I, I just hit W on, you know, instinct. Hmm. It's a book called, that reads The Cult of the Torn Region. Would you like to read it? Sure! The Torn Region has far as we know, always been under the threat of different legendary worshipping cults. There are five cults currently in power. The Cult of Dark Ride, which is where we are right now, the Abyssal Cult, Infernal Cult, and Sky Cult, and a group simply called Perfection. All these cults are extremely dangerous and should be treated with extreme caution. Alright. Well, there's one thing that these cults don't know is that Busted makes me feel good! I'm sorry, I watched this Busted new video not too long ago, and uh... Ever since then, I've been busted. And feeling good. Oh, what up? Mew is holding a small note. I choose Mew to help you. Of this mess due to its special ability. Synchronize? I choose you to help you out this due to its special ability, yes. It is uh, able to transform into the ability. <laughs> it, it's able to use transform to change its form and disguise itself as something else. However, unlike Ditto, you can transform you as well. If you can find DNA, you can disguise you as someone else. You should be able to use this to escape the base. Good luck, your benefactor, who I will compassionately call Benny from this way forward. And... Ooh. Well, this is a nice little scene. No, there's a ketchup party. Uh, maybe a hot, maybe a sriracha party. <sighs> it's a large statue of Dark Rye. It's cold to the touch, and you feel tired. And yeah, just standing around it. All right. Well, let's get some uh, tacos and dip in the sriracha. Oh, it's actually dried up blood, splattered on the ground. Yay, DNA. Yo. Hmm. Mew seems to be trying to tell Deluxe something with its eyes. I know, Mew. I know how you feel about busting. It also makes me feel good. Busting makes me feel good! <laughs> I need to stop doing that. <laughs> okay, so... Since we got, you know, DNA and fingerprints of, you know, cultists... Let's just grab the shit that's in here. Because, you know... Power. Mmm. You know how we all feel about busting. Oh, been in here. Yes. Fuck. Okay. Oh, what's up? Oh, wait, these are bo cardboard boxes on the ground, aren't they? For a while there, I thought they were just like random nubs that are just installed in the ground for some reason. Or just like a button. But why would a place need so many buttons that are just reeling the hallways? And okay, well. Anyway, let's just go ahead and uh, go to that place that requires my handprint. Or this guy's handprint, because it's technically not mine. I kind of took it. But I'm sure... That if I'm getting any, you know, messages from the dried blood on the ground, I'm pretty sure the guy doesn't need it. 
pretty sure the guy has already found, like, no use for it. Pretty sure. Pretty sure he's not live right now. Just realize that I have banned again and set to 20 minutes intervals. Well, I guess I'm going to be stitching a bunch of these together then. Uh, I should pause it. Okay, I'll be really quickly. Alright. Alright. Now it's set to 30 minutes. So, this first episode is probably going to be like, you know, 50 minutes long video or so. So, 50 minutes and a few, and like some change. What the fuck's going on here? Is this carpet or grass? I'm, it looks like grass. Why is there just grass in the floor? Man, this interior decorator sucks. There's boxes and grass everywhere. Hey. Ferris phones finally decided to give the summoning of Dark Ride another try. Last time it just flew away. How does she know that it's not uh, gonna happen again? I don't know. How do you know? How do you not see this me behind me? Yay, Brian Hill. Ooh, my bookcases. Education! It's a book about the cult of Dark Ride. Would you like to read it? Sure, why in the fuck not? Cult of Dark Ride is read by a woman named Fish Bone. Like most other cults in the region, they have made their goal to summon Dark Cry from the different world. Most of her reasons for trying to call Dark Cry are unknown, but she is suspected to be a scientistic to have statistic tendencies due to events in her childhood. Oh. Freudian, right? Oh, no, I don't. That, that, that would, no. The Calyx Wars, ooh. Sure, that sounds actually interesting. The Aroma Calyx War was a war between Calyx and Aroma uh, regions. And it's renowned for the first interregion war that include the use of Pokemon as fighting tools. Kalos eventually won the war by using what has basically the what was basically nuclear weaponry, an ultimate weapon charged by legendary Pokemon. Is, is there nuke? Do, do, do they know nukes? No, no, no. Do they know about nuclear power in the Pokemon universe? Anyways, what's up, buddy? The ritual of Ferris von Nori does always fascinate me. As horrifying as they are, it's a weird idea that some chanting and blood can call forth something as powerful as Darkrai. Yeah, it kind of makes no sense. I wonder how she does it. Yeah, but also, there's a pink fucking entity following me that can float through walls, so... I only joined this cult. A few months ago, and I don't know everything about what happened last time they summoned Dark Riot, but apparently it escaped. I hope it doesn't happen again. I don't want to see Ferris on angry. You look really familiar, do I? Do you from somewhere? Uh, nah. Hey man, don't distract me. I'm trying to concentrate here. Don't distract me, I'm trying to concentrate here! We drew straws to see who would have to be sacrificed this year. The fact that it could be... Could be me... Easily... Could have been me... Up there scares me more than I'd like to admit! Ah! Alright. And so we begin. Miss, please! You can't do this! I, I don't want to die! You sworn when you joined that you would give your life to us. How is this any different? Activate the ritual circle. Activating. Dark cry, Lord of Darkness. I call upon you to enter our world. I, in return, offer you the soul of this loyal servant 
to be bound to your world of nightmares forever. Vocal Vitrum Umbrium Dominium. So you're sending him to a nightmare realm. That's nice of you. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, damn. Oh. 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 Hey. Darkrai, Lord Nightmares! You are the great pouncer of the world. You punish the great and slay the immortal. It was it has been a year since I saw you last. You remember what occurred then? You accomplished something incredible that day. I thought finally you had accepted our offer to join us, but you fled soon after, never to be seen again. But now I call upon you again. Darkrai, why will you not join me? I know my sister has seen you time and time again. Why do you favor her over me? Why, Daddy, why? <laughs> I beseech you, Darkrai, join me. Join the cult that has worshipped you for so long. With my guidance and your power, the world could be ours. Later, bitch! <laughs> well, isn't this just lovely? I like how the lovely is italicized. It's probably gone off to Celine City to see my sister again. What a waste of a grunt. And what do you two want exactly? Miss, please. I'm confident if we had another try, we could trap Doc right here. We could know why it wouldn't work this time, but if you'll just give us another chance. Get out of my way. Fire Blast. Okay, and they disappeared. I'm going to check on the prisoner. None of you better follow me. Okay, someone's not in good mood. Hey, hey, this fucked up. I think that chat would make diet. You know what? Let's try some. Yay! <laughs> I was wondering if I could just transform into me and see how I can fuck up like that. Oh wait, that reminds me. Quick save of feet. Um, because I would have probably fucked myself <laughs> if that worked. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 go. Yes! Motherfucker! And yes, V to quick save. Oh, wait, wait, I, I saw. Saw another hood boy over here. First phone's down there, checking on the prisoner. I want to go down there if I were you. Don't want to make her any more mad. Alright, later. I'm going to go out for some oxygen. Woo, okay. Is he going to again? There's no reason to use that now. Okay. I just like their fashion taste. God. Alright. Let's get it going. Let's get it go. Oh fuck. Oh hey, our first battle. It's... Oh, this is what a mystery challenge is. Oh, fuck me. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh. 
Oh, this sucks. Oh, that sucks. I don't like this. I don't. Can't turn that off? Can Fuck. Forfeit? Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, science, Jesus. Yes. Thank... No, thank you. For nothing. Oh, hey. Let's see what... Oh, thank you, Weedle. I'm so glad to see you. You have no idea how happy I am to see you. But, you, know, you gotta die now. Woo! Oh, man. Uh, that scared me. I thought I couldn't change that. Okay. There is a small flute and another note in Mew's hands. The quartz flute. Deluxe with the court flute in the book. Oh, this flute lets you call upon Mew when it needed. To use it, go into your bag and either use it directly or register it. Good luck. Benny. Thanks, Ben! Oh. I kind of swear I saw Mew here just now. Hmm. Did... Did you see it? The tiny pink Pokemon? It, it was floating. Very close to you. Bitch you crazy, but yeah. I knew it! I've always wanted to see a, a Pokemon that rare. This could be my break. I could Trav... This. You could be Travis. Is your name Travis? My name's Damien. Oh, okay, you're not Travis. <gasps> My name's Damien. I'm an aspiring Pokemon trainer. And you are? Deluxe. Got it. You came to Telnor Town at the perfect time. The Augur, the greatest man in the world, of course, is coming today. You know the augers, right? Fuck nah! How could you not? Have you been living under a rock? Eh, more like caged in a secret base, but yeah. He's the guy who protects the region. He's my biggest hero. The mayor and the townsfolk have been preparing ever since this morning. Wait, the guys didn't have a week prepared, or... God, you guys are so unprepared. I'm excited. I'm just running errands before he arrives. Before he arrives. Yeah, God damn it. I need to get some drink from my voice. I know. Why don't you help out? We're signing jobs in the town hall. You know, cleaning and so on. Okay, so this is a uh, what the fuck town, right? <coughs> uh, quick save, real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, um, oh, hey, yo, hi there. I am an employee of the Pokemart. It's a convenience store chain that can be found in the top of any. Pokemon Center! Just look, just like this one! Here! The center is an important place for any trainer to know. You can heal Pokemon, buy things, or even the bottom floor to buy the bottles. I hope you take these for 
free sample. Five Pokeballs, thank you, good sir. Hmm, thank you, thank you very much. Alright. So, currently I have the egg lock slash nudge lock situation on my hands here, so. It's the lab. Oh, yes, yeah, it's the lab. Hello, I'm, po I'm Professor Sylvan. I'm the professor in this town. I suppose you want to start your Pokemon adventure. Most of the kids in the neighborhood have already got, uh, gotten their Eevee from me and headed off north to the trainer school in Midna town. You will have to wait a little bit, though. The town is busy preparing for the uh, for the Alger arrival, so it's something. Why don't you come back later? Sure thing. <sighs> but okay. So when I uh, capture a Pokemon, I'm going to go straight to my um. Straight to my, uh... Fucking thing! God, why am I tired? I have to go right towards my, um... PC. Uh... Is that everything, um... Amonka? It's an Amonka on that flag, okay. I think that's how you say it, right? Hey, what? Hey, what's up? Both of kids, we're trying to talk here. And we're here to talk. We're not here to talk to you. Hey, that's pretty fucking rude. I wonder if they're swearing in this. Both of kids. Okay, you both are assholes. Hey, yeah, dude. I'm gonna draw the auger a portrait when he arrives here. <sighs> I mean, after all, everyone in town I suppose, is supposed to give him a gift. Really? Hey. Talnor Town is a small town in the east of Torn uh, region. We're far away from most of the cities and the uh, high life, but we're happy here. Oh, so happy. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Hey. Yo. Yo. Hey, man, I'm here. Hey. I finished cleaning up the road. It, I'm finished cleaning up the road. Is there anything else I can do? Oh. This is Deluxe. I met them. Them. I am one person. Thank you very much. Outside. They offered to help. Too. I'm not doing a voice. <laughs> my voice is just act my throat is actually pretty dry right now. I need to get something to drink. But after this conversation. Nice to meet you, Deluxe. Well, Damien. Well, Damien, I think you're pretty well finished. As long as you have your gift for the auger ready, I think you're done. Do you have your... You do have your gift, right? Oh. Well, uh... I may have forgotten. Of course you have. You disappoint me, son. You are now exiled from our family. Now leave. Right away, immediately. You cannot collect anything. You better find one. And fast, you heard. You you can find a rare stone in the one of the caves in the forest. Of course, you need a Pokemon to uh, go safely. No! Absolutely not! A, not a chance! Damien is not ready to get a Pokemon. He's still just a child! Mom, please! Everyone else in the town already got to theirs and has left. And... 
possibly three of them are starving to death. <laughs> and you're not going to follow them. You'll get yourself killed. Why do you care? It's not like you're my real mom or anything. Whoa! Bitch! Bitch! Hold on now. Uh, hold on. What a fucking dick! What a dick! I don't like this kid. I raised you since birth! You're not capable of raising a plant. Let alone a Pokemon. Okay, you, you kind of... Like, you both have your bad sides. You're irresponsible, antisocial, and you can't even... Wow, you are... Wow! You're just straight up insulting him now. That's mean. That's enough out of you, too. You're embarrassing us. You said your name's Deluxe. I'm sure you handled a Pokemon before. Yeah, sure. We'll lend one to both of you and Jane. Would you be willing to help him do the virus? And do the cave and to help him and be a fuck? Yes. Wonderful. I'm very grateful. So, uh, it's settled then. Deluxe will help Damien to get a gift. For the auger, and if Damien shows responsibility, perhaps you can keep the Pokemon afterwards. Well, how does that sound? Fine. He won't, though. Wow. What a bitch. Deluxe, let's go. I'll meet you in the professor's lab to get an Eevee. Mm. She's gonna do something fucking this shit. Shit, shit. I really hope I don't mess this up. Ah, I'll show you something. And let's just say uh, Deluxe Skanks recording on the thumbs of me. Hey, no problem, man. It really means a lot. And I know Deluxe is a good guy. Okay, I'll be right back. Alright. I am now clean and clear and under my throat. Let's get going. Oh, hey. Hey, I want to talk to you. Oh, second dog of this dog brand possum. Yes, Richard. What? Kyogre? That's not physically possible. Okay. You got anything else to say about the. The nose is amazing. I can talk to my friends all over the world. I can share Pokemon Bell. Or even visit the Oasis. That's great, man. That's fucking great. Hey, how are you? Are you a trainer? If you want to succeed, you need to be ready for anything. Oh, dude, you're awesome. Thanks. Those bushes let you hit. Hey, I like you. You're a good guy. Uh, hey, do you give me things? Do you have a phone? I'm sure there's a bunch of Eevees. All right. That sounds... That's cool. There's Professor Blue's Pokemon, the Freaks. No, no other trainer would want them, and we can't keep them any longer. All I want is for you to take them as <laughs> to take them. You already keep a bunch of ease as these. Surely these three won't be a problem. Father, why do you care? Why do you care about them? I don't know what you've done. It's true, I'm merciless. I will, I've done some awful things, but there's no reason for these Pokemon to die. Um, hello. I'm Damien, the Deluxe. The d we are also known as the Double D's. <laughs> um, we're here to get Pokemon, so we can go into the forest safely. Philippines! Sylvian, if you don't take these Pokemon, I'll release them. And they're sure to die in the world. 
if you want, you can just give them to these kids, right? Put them on the table. Very well. Boop, boop, boop. Hey, excuse me, please. Hey, what a gentleman. So, you two are in need of a Pokemon? Yes, ma'am. I see. That man was in he that was in here was just now. He was one of my colleagues in university. He's a smart and great. He's a smart man and a great scientist. He's also the leader of a cult of a professor. <laughs> Wait, a cult leader? Those people are evil, Professor. You shouldn't be talking to them that alone. Be accepting gifts from them. Motherfucker. Tell me, Damien, the Lux. Have you ever heard of something called Delta Species? I want to sound smart, so yes. Uh, well, I haven't. Well, allow me to explain. Delta Pokemon are based on a phenomenon in the whole region far away. These Pokemon that have different DNA than normal Pokemon. Simply put, they're typed differently than normal. For example, it would be an electric type Dragonite or a water type Porygon. These Pokemon are on the table now are Deltas. I'm not sure what type they are, but they seem to be experiments of Bulbasaur, Trimander, and Squirtle. They're scientific marvels. I would love to keep on to study. Now, normally I would give you an Eevee as a Pokemon to start you off on your journey. However, it seems there are three more options for you to choose from. So, I will offer you this. You may choose one of these three Delta Pokemon to travel with, or the Eevee I normally give away. If you want an Eevee, talk to me. Otherwise, take your pick. Deluxe! I don't know! What to do? I don't like the idea of Pokemon being made by a murderer. But I don't like the idea of these Pokemon left all alone forever. You can't pick up very yeah, other driving. Oh, okay. You no, know I think I'm gonna pause real quick and extend the time I got here. So I just gave myself another hour. <laughs> all right. So let's check these out. So, this is Bulbasaur, guys, poison. It really doesn't matter what I pick, does it? These would be deltas, right? Yeah. Thanks. Sure. Rest in goodbye. <laughs> Rest and go! Switch your Pokemon for it. Yep. So, I guess we'll just go through, you know, all these here. So, let's go. But, oh, come on. Alright. Okay. Okay. So we'll just start here, I guess. Number one. Thank you. And wonder what we go and get. Place right there. And okay. Huh? Oh, you so showed these eggs just hatched right away. Ooh. Oh, uh, what are we going to get? Is that a shiny gra- 
Juke cane. Ooh. Is that a shiny tree cone? No, it's fine. Yay! And oh, thank God I picked the freaking fire type. Oh, you love to absorb. <laughs> huh. Deluxe, I think you're right. What? Yeah, you grab that one. <laughs> hey, Deluxe. Before we go into the shade forest, how about a battle? It'll be the perfect thing to test our new Pokemon. Let's go. I think my Pokemon might be a shiny. <laughs> what up, Damien? A rival? Squirrel. Yeah. Yeah! <gasps> oh my god, he is a shiny! Oh, look at this motherfucker! Oh, you're good! A grassy dragon. Oh, you're gonna kick his ass! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Why are you level 7? Alright, so, uh, yep, yeah, more absorbing. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Suck him up good. Yeah, Jukane! Jukane, my. S oh, I'm so proud of this guy! What have been what have been the chances of another starter? <laughs> what randomly generated Pokemon's great. Yeah, my boy. My boy Jukane. He be a Jukane. Give me the monies. <laughs> wow, you're a great battler. Do you think you're? Uh, do you think? Mm, do you think? You could take on a gym someday? I'm sure, maybe, maybe. Alright, Deluxe, here's the deal. I'm going to go north, I'm going to head north to Shade Forest. At the northern end, the forest is a large cave, and in the middle of that cave is a rare stone we're looking for. We'll meet. I'll meet you there, okay? Yeah, okay. Uh. <laughs> and Deluxe, can I talk to you for a moment? Yeah, sure. Damien rushed off before I could give him one, but I think you can have this. Yay! Pokedex. This is a Pokedex, short for Pokemon Index. Uh, it is a data collection for all Pokemon that I give to trainers. If you see a Pokemon, it will be registered in Pokedex somehow. And this is just records all the time. If you catch one, the Pokemon will be full of data. And the books will be full of data regarding that Pokemon. Anyway, now that you've gotten that, you you should be all set to go on your adventure. Head up north to Tolnor Cave, deep in the forest. Be careful and good luck. Thanks, Sylvan. Alright. Oh, look at Jukan. Look at Jukane. Look at Jukane. Jukane is taking it easy. Fuck yeah, you are. Fuck yeah. Jukane's the motherfucking boss. I'm so proud. Let's, 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 let's learn about a new friend here, okay? Jukane. Summary. He's a fucking motherfucking Trico. A shiny motherfucking Trico. He's docile as fuck. Yeah. No, no, you aren't. But okay. You, you aren't. You aren't born in the year 2000. Jukane is still undecided. Hey, what the fuck? Dude, take it easy though. Alright. So, let's see you. Oh, it was in Pokemon Center, and I'm just playing Pokemon and doing now stuff. Alright, cool. Alright, alright. So. <laughs> so, so here's the Pokemon stuff. This is probably a good idea for me to take. Oh, I have six already? Oh, yeah, that one guy. Let's make it. 
Okay, so I got ten Pokeballs. That should be, that should do me. Wait, and just in case, because I know how fucked up things can get, I want to take three of those. And especially since Trico, I mean Duquesne, is uh, vulnerable. Fucking Duquesne. Duquesne. Duquesne be juking. Alright. Also, we're going to be capturing our first Pokemon here. Okay. And it's going to be this punk. Alright, you game. Show them what's up. Uh, yeah, just absorb him. Let's keep on doing that for a while. Yeah, it's going to be suck. Sucking this thing dry until it's low enough. <laughs> Life orb. Just keep on sucking dry. Alright, that should be not enough. It's Life Orb! Hey, what? Whatever, fine. Jucane is down with the business. I want. I kind of want to switch out my customs it, soon. Okay. I can't. I can't quick save from here. Okay. All right. So the first guy here is uh, we're going to capture this Caterpie. Thank you, Caterpie. <laughs> I think I'm just going to norm a number to these guys. Yeah, you're definitely a worm. So it doesn't really matter what Pokemon I have to capture, so, eh. Alright, so, let's go name number two. <laughs> Wait, I don't even think... Oh, hey, Pokegear. Cool. Thanks. Make a big deal about that. Alright. Alright. So let's see our second Pokemon. Okay. So. So who's our buddy going to be here? Let's, let's find out. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I'm so excited. Alright, so I think we just have to move around a little bit. It yeah, there it is. Alright, who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Who's gonna be Duquesne's new friend here? Oh, Patrick! Patrick Star! I get it. I get it. Uh, no, he's, he's fine. Here he is. Yeah, Patrick. Oh, he's no water gun, too. Okay, we got a good start here, man. Alright. Oh, uh, so before I continue, I want to say thank you for 100 subs, by the way. Um, that's great. It's been a long time coming. Um, I, uh, yeah, I started, like, YouTube more than a year ago, and my strategy wasn't great, but within that year, I released over 800, I think I'm at... 830 videos now? And so, I really gotta thank you guys for the 100 subs. I think currently I'm at 105, because, you know, I got a lot. I got a few at one time that just put me over 100 subs, but, yeah. Thank you very much. It, it means a lot. Because I put a lot of me in these videos, so you liking these videos and subscribe to my channel means you like me, and so I like you back. <laughs> Uh, alright. So, this is the end of the 100 video special, the first episode of Pokemon Insurgents. So if you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, share videos, and uh, yeah, until next time you guys, 
Jukane and Patrick are going to mess stuff up. Alright. Bye!